Before operating the machine, thoroughly read safety and operation information in the operator's manual. Press the machine configuration button on the home screen to display the cleaner setup menu button which opens a screen with three cleaner setup parameters. The cleaner drive speed is adjustable by pressing the plus or minus buttons on the screen. With the machine at high idle and the cleaner running, use the buttons to set the desired cleaner speed while watching the cleaner speed readout in the corner post display. The drive speed range is 500 to 700 RPM. The cleaner drive speed alarm is adjusted in 5 RPM increments from 500 to 700 RPM. If cleaner speed drops below the set point, an alarm is sounded to alert the operator. In certain operating conditions, the operator may choose to harvest without the use of the cleaner. Press the Cleaner Bypass Mode checkbox. When a check mark is displayed, the cleaner drive system will not engage. A lever on the top left end of the cleaner must be moved to the bypass position so cotton passes directly from the header duct to the accumulator. When the engine is stopped while in bypass mode, the machine will default back to normal cleaner mode upon restarting. The air system ducts behind the header are adjustable to change the crop flow capacity and green bull separation characteristics of the machine. See the air system section in the operator's manual for step-by-step -step procedures to make these adjustments. In the maximum vacuum pressure configuration, the lower duct door is open 4 inches, allowing the maximum vacuum to be created in the duct by the fan pressure nozzle for best crop flow in normal conditions. The door is normally not completely closed in harvest operation. If green bowls are being delivered to the cleaner, the first step to improve separation is to open the lower duct door completely. This slows the crop flow somewhat and allows the heavier bowls to fall to the bottom of the crop flow. As the slower moving bowls attempt to turn upward through the duct, they instead strike the separator angles on the rear side of the duct and fall down through the open lower duct door. If separation is still insufficient and excessive green bowls are entering the cleaner, the louver duct and upper panel can be adjusted downward, lowering the rear edge of the panel to direct the crop flow downward, striking the separator angles more directly. Heavier green bowls in the crop flow are deflected downward while the lighter cotton turns and is pulled up the duct by the system air flow. For maximum crop flow with minimal separation, the top duct panels can be adjusted upward, increasing the radius in the turn from the lower to upper duct areas. In this position, the duct area is enlarged with the least restriction to crop flow. In normal operation, the louvered duct behind the header is closed. If greater vacuum is needed at the front of the duct, directly behind the cross auger to relieve clogging, open the louvers in small increments. More air will be drawn into the forward part of the duct, pulling cotton from the header. Gradually close the lower duct door as the louvers are open to maintain vacuum at the lower end of the duct. For more detailed information, refer to the operator's manual.